When I was a child, I heard a story that left a lasting impression on me. It was the story of the little Dutch boy who discovered a leak in a dike that was holding back the ocean from flooding his countryside. And this little boy, instead of running away from the danger, went toward the danger and plugged that hole with his finger and, and stopped the leak. And this image stuck in my brain as a child, and I carry it all the way through to today, of, of this little boy and how weak he is compared to the weight of the world's oceans. There's such a difference there. It seems, seems futile. It seems, seems hopeless. Well, as an adult, that image has kind of haunted me because I've chosen a life of service which means I'm always dealing with lots of problems that belong to lots of different people. And it doesn't just seem like I am like that Dutch boy holding back a leak, but maybe I'm like the Dutch boy holding back lots of leaks. I've only got 10 fingers, and yet there's 11 leaks, which means I have to pick and choose. And, and sometimes I even have to, to let a leak go because there's another leak I have to tend to, and it pains my sense of justice that I can't fix everything, that I can't solve all the problems and be everywhere at once. Well, as an adult, I've gone back and reread that story too. It's actually a story within a story, but the way it's told, the little Dutch boy finds the leak and he knows the danger to his town and so while alone, he goes forward and he plugs that leak. And he does that through the night and it's bitterly cold and it's terribly difficult. He suffers to do this, but he holds firm and he sticks to it and does the right thing until the townspeople find him in the morning. This is what I need to focus on, not solving all the world's problems and, and fixing everything that I come in contact with. But I need to do good where I can do good. Romans 12, 21 says, Do not be overcome by evil, but overcome evil with good. I can do the good that the Lord wants me to do in the place where I am. And you know what? He'll take care of everything else. I can't solve all the problems in the world, but I can choose to do the righteous thing where the Lord's planted me. I can choose to do good where I am, in my city, around the people that I know in my place in this time. I can do good things here, even if I can't solve all of the other problems. I pray that wherever you serve, that you too will have the courage to do what is right, to stand up for what is true, to defend the oath that you've taken, and to do the right thing and overcome evil with good. May God bless you.